this video is for if you have one of these faucets. Um, mine was missing the piece that goes in here. Um, fortunately, they, uh, I, there's one other faucet. Or no, I'm sorry. I had this one was not missing. Um, the one I have one other faucet like this that's down downstairs. It was missing this piece. This piece was still here in this one, but it wouldn't flow water through when you turn it on. Uh, water coming to it is fine. It just wouldn't go through the, uh, the well, it's this thing. This is for to uh, prevent backflow. It's a, I forget exactly what it's called. Anyway, there was a model number written on, on it. It's a model 34, uh, there it is, 30, 34H. That was what that one was. This one is an HA. There's a couple others with different letters behind them, but they're all the same thing. Just the different letter levers from what I gather determine what it's made of. Some of them are chrome. This one's brass, uh, but the water wouldn't flow out of that one. So this thing was about 25 to $35. I can't remember how much it's kind of expensive for something that quite honestly, you probably really don't even need on here. But with these, you know, it's not a regular hookup. You can't just put something on. So I was missing one anyway. So I went ahead and ordered a new one so I could have both working. But the, uh, the one that I pulled off here, the reason it wasn't working, it just wouldn't flow. Water, water wouldn't flow out of this. So if you're ever having that issue, to, if you don't want to replace it, spend the money to replace it, what I'd look down in here and see those little holes there several of them the metal tabs in between were cracked or broken so when the water is flowing into this this way it would push that brass plate down against a rubber diaphragm that's in there and essentially plug it off so i just took a chance got me some needle nose in there and whatever i could and broke the rest of the tabs out pulled this plate out so now it, it no longer functions as a anti-vacuum or a, a backflow preventer however pulling that plate out allowed the water to flow through and out into the water hose like it's supposed to so i could care less about the backflow it's not an issue to me um especially since i'm on a well but uh, it flows out fine perfect free fix you don't have to get one of these i wouldn't have even bought this but I was literally missing one. I only had one. So there you go. It's for a Woodford is the brand name of these, these uh, faucets. See how green and, and patina this is. This piece was very green and patina. I could barely make out that model. It just said model 34H. And had I not been able to see that, I would not have known what this is. But I looked up that model number and up came Woodford and all these pieces. So if you have one like this, if it's missing, there you go. Model 34H. This is what the faucet looks like. Um, if it stops flowing, try taking that out. What do you got to lose?